She is. She is the wonderful person. Spirit Sister. We, our descendants. will be extraterrestrial visitors. These extraterrestrial civilizations are here to help us. None of them are hostile. By the way, and if you go to and Google this, The Associated Press reported we don't have access to it was a terrible moment or in most cases Completely. Now, this is the admiral in charge of blocking. Such are the things I have witnessed. This is a serious problem. Problem in China need to gather together with Mr. Obama. Step forward with us and end the secrecy. Most of those guys couldn't find their ass in a well-lighted room. Anyway, she's a saint. Across the vastness of space. And I thought to myself, light years across. 
Feste. Distance that a beam of light the time since the birth of Christ. to say hello that science is consciousness because they have technologies of extraterrestrial Contact. And it isn't the SETI project. Air, their technology. that are WSFM, an extraterrestrial spacecraft or being, and there has been a mental component to it, and then contact them. Would they go And guess what? They almost always come. Snowflake, no two are alike. Is the same light. And as I had this, conversation before the cabal started shooting to the president and to others and I have more than a dozen people who have been inside these covert operations absolutely before we landed on the moon we already had those technologies hoax most people don't know And this is the information. Don't be deceived again. And there is no hostile intent. technologies to 
to track Inside that dome was in a conventional radar. It was an electromagnetic scalar weapon. So this insanity has been going on since before I was born in 19. in our meditations and in our prayers. And in our our speech and in our thoughts. And in that new civilization, we will be able to evolve on this planet as a civilization enlightened in peace, sustainability, to protect Gaia and the biosphere and create the world of our vision. The earth must be preserved. And these visitors, some call them guardians of life on earth, are not going to allow one generation of men to destroy the biosphere and the planet and the promise of humanity. These extraterrestrial civilizations are here to help us. It's about new energy and the transformation of our civilization from one that right now is headed over a cliff and needs to be brought back up, Phoenix-like, uh, from the ashes. Universal peace, interplanetary relations, a new civilization that has no pollution, free energy, abundance for the elimination of poverty in the world. If you're not willing to take a risk for that, you don't have a soul. I mean, you're not worthy of breathing the free air of Earth. These gentlemen believe that this planet is being visited by beings from another world who, for whatever reason, have taken an interest in the nuclear arms race. Whoever are aboard these craft are sending a signal to both Washington and Moscow, among others, that we are playing with fire, that the possession and threatened use of nuclear weapons potentially threatens the human race and the integrity of the planetary environment.